and nimble as fuck. I can't wait to get my first ticket. Oh my god, I'm so excited! I'm just gonna have a party with the cop and be like, dude, you got me my first ticket on a motorcycle. You should be proud of yourself. I just, I'll just tell them straight up, like, man, I've been getting away with bullshit for so long. <laughs> I'm a menace! Just kidding, I'm not a menace. I try to give motorcycles a good name. Occasionally, I get a little excited and start weaving in and out of traffic like a fucking moron, but that's fine. God damn it, that's the second motherfucker that hasn't looked and come into my lane. Jesus! Fucking minivan and there was a truck back there a little ways, but I didn't have a camera on. Good thing I knew where my horn is. Jesus. Might go to a hockey game tonight. That's a thing in Colorado, hockey. I bet those guys have some fucking major TBIs. Hockey players. People get all upset about football players. It's like, man, have you seen hockey? There's some awesome footage of there, uh, out there on the internet webs of hockey players getting their fucking throats cut by ice skates. Like, they go down in a fucking puddle over by the goal, and then somebody stands up and there's just blood pouring out on the ice. It's like, what? You gotta have big, big, hardcore lady man balls. Big cojones. I don't know, big balls. It takes a lot of gumption to be a hockey player. Yeah, fuck that. I might talk a big game, but I do not want to fuck around on ice skates with a couple of throat slitting blades on my feet and like test my luck with somebody who's gonna like might be having a road a roid rage. No thanks. Get off your phone, bitch! God damn it, I saw you! Don't fucking look at me like you're all guilty. You are guilty! Blowing right through Drake, let's go. It's fucking no stopping. Yes, yes. That's what I like to see. Green lights. Ain't nothing but green lights. What I see, that'd be the greatest. <whistles> nice try, Honda. Till all the leaves are gone and then the trees are just fucking scary like that shitty forest in Snow White. Yep. That's what I think of when it gets to be wintertime. Creepy, grabby, tree arm people. Oh my god, bungholes, let's move! Make it late! Finish my paper, woke up at 2 a.m. to do it! Hurry up, pucker. Hurry up, don't make me lose balance! Dick! Oh my god, don't fucking turn right. Don't fucking turn right. God damn it! Hurry up! Fuck! Whoa, 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 what the fuck, asshole? Fuck you! Fuck you very much! Jesus! What's this souped up thing right here? What do we got? That what is that? are you? Other than sexy. GTX? Roadrunner! Fuck yeah, dude! Yes! Yes! That is a fucking cool 440 Roadrunner in green? That is bitchin'. That is a bitching car. Oh, please pull in front of me. Oh my god, you are cool, man. So cool. Damn! Damn, damn, that's a nice car. Okay, pay attention, shit. Aquarium, aka little watery prisons for fish. I gotta watch it on these corners. I've been scraping my skid plate. I'm a speed demon. Aha! We've got a Star Wars geek over here in the Subaru. We've got a resistance shield emblem thingy. Oh, back when chill. Star Wars for life. Oh, speaking of Star Wars, I dressed up as Rey from the Star Wars The Force Awakens. That was last year's big Disney premiere of the new Star Wars movies. She's the new heroine. She's amazing. She's this kick-ass 
orphan child that lived in a sand crotch out there in fucking space. And uh, rumor has it she is Luke Skywalker's daughter, right? Anyway, don't I like it? We had too many spoilers for you squares that haven't seen it. But she's a kick-ass character and I really like her. So I dressed up as her for Halloween and rode to campus on Monday that way. And I looked so fucking cool. Unfortunately, the footage I got that day was totally messed up. And there was no sound! But it was great dressing up with Mountain Man for our Halloween parties because he was Django Fett. Um, and I do believe it is Boba Fett that gets thrown to the Sarlacc pit. So the joke kind of misapplies a little bit. But I did tell him, I said, hey Mountain Man, you know what I'd like? I'd like to throw you into my Sarlacc pit. Okay, I didn't really say that, but... I'm gonna crack it on him. And I'm gonna crack that joke before he gets time to edit this footage, and it's gonna be great. So you watch yourself. I didn't wanna look like a huge jack off just now when I parked on this fine Wednesday morning, but the dude that parked next to me is a Yamaha R6. It's pretty dope. He's obviously a reputable customer just like me. He's got this sick Halo looking Master Chief helmet. Fucking cool. Sweet little windshield on there. Neato! End of the bar. Mirrors, all that good jazz. Cool. Just wanted to correct myself, take a minute there. I don't want to talk to him because he looked like too cool for me. He did the cool guys don't look at explosions walk out of here, so like he didn't even acknowledge me. Like, fuck. But I suppose since I didn't take my helmet off, that's probably why. Anyway, T squared out. <laughs>